video, I'm going to talk about the four BGP message types. So this is a table that I got from a book that I am reading called CCNP Routing and Switching Route 300-101 by Kevin Wallace. Uh, it's a really good book. <clears throat> you can just Google it if you want to take a look. <clears throat> So uh, I've got three columns, message, purpose, and um, similarity with EIGRP. So basically, um, the similarities uh, of these messages to the um, messages that uh, EIGRP is using using so. <clears throat> so let's talk about open message or BGP open message a BGP open message is basically what it used to try to establish a neighbor relationship and exchange basic uh, parameters so basically uh, before a uh, let me just draw a topology here. <clears throat> so let's say here. Uh, so basically, when this router uh, wants to uh, wants to establish a neighborship, establish a neighborship with this router, uh, what? Uh, a BGP neighborship with this router, what it does is it sends a hello message, I mean a, a open message in this case, uh, to, the, to the other router. And, and that open message, it includes uh, basic parameters like, um, you know, the ESN number, the authentication value, if there is, um, and other things. So that is basically the open message. And of course, um, it is similar to the hello message used uh, in EIGRP. So <clears throat> number two is keep alive so it's got now let me just read the purpose here so sent on a big periodic basis to maintain the neighbor relationship the neighbor relationship the lack of receipt of a keep alive message within the negotiated toll timer causes BGP to bring down the neighborship the neighbor connection so basically it is a it is a mes message that uh, these routers use, you know, uh, after they have become neighbors and, you know, the state, the BGP state uh, is established. Uh, these routers send keep alive messages, you know, to, you know, to know, I mean, to inform each other that you know, they are still uh, alive or up and running. And when, for example, uh, this router here, let's say this is router one, router two. Uh, for example, router two uh, has not received a keep alive message and a uh, Keep alive message for like uh, I think it's a three times the number of um, keep alive message. Like for example, uh, uh, let's say one second. Uh, let's say we we set the keep alive. I mean, let's say we set this router R one to send a keep alive every one second, and not very sure, but I think the whole timer will uh, will be. Uh, I, I think.
think three times of the uh, keep alive uh, message. So that, this would be three. So if this if router two has not received a keep alive message uh, in, uh, for example, three seconds or four seconds, router two will assume that R one has gone down, has gone down. So BGP uh, will bring down the neighbor connection uh, on R two. So that is basically what keep alive is and uh, it is similar to the hello message in EIGRP. Uh, let's talk about update message. Uh, an update message is used to change PAs and the associated prefixes that use those PAs. So prefixes um, in EBGP prefixes are also known as NLRI, a network layer reachability information. So when the, let's say, you know, the neighborship has been established uh, between these uh, peers, um, at that time or at that point, each other can send update, an update uh, message. <clears throat> You know, including the PAs or path attributes. So uh, it's got an equivalent. I mean, it is similar to the update message used in EIGRP. So <clears throat> let's talk about uh, notification. Uh, notification is used to signal a BGP error, typically results in a reset to the neighbor relationship. So basically, a uh, notification message is used to signal that there is an <clears throat> error uh, uh, with the BGP process. For example, you know, uh, if, uh, this, if this router here uh, is trying to, um, you know, uh, trying to communicate with R2 and trying to to have a neighborship be, neighborship between neighborships with R2 and the parameters uh, and the parameters that these that these routers are using don't match then um, there will be notification message and the BGP will not uh, establish between the two routers. Uh, it doesn't have a direct equivalent uh, message in the IGRP, as you can see here, no direct equivalent. So yeah, <clears throat> uh, to summarize, um, we have four uh, BGP message types. BGP message types and they are open, keep alive, update, notification. So <clears throat> that's it for this. That's it for BGP message types. Um, I'm going to talk about more <clears throat> networking stuff in the future videos. Thanks for watching. Bye.